Hey there everybody and welcome back to Blacklight Retribution. This is one of my favorite maps. It's confined, it's tiny, it's actually ooh, very painful usually. Oh damn, that was a gas grenade, I didn't realize. It's one of my favorite matches though because everything is so tight and tiny and closed in. You pretty much have to watch your back all the time or you will get taken out without a second thought. And I know there's someone in there. And gas grenade. If anything, that just covered me coming in. Oh, whoa, what was... Oh, I ran into his explosive mine at the same time. Damn it, I should have taken that out first. Thank you, Korg. And also with it being so tiny, like I just spawned literally next to that guy and that other guy. So you can actually spawn right next to someone and it makes it very interesting for like how fast you have to react to your surroundings. Okay. Eat that, Reznak. Okay. I don't need to heal yet, I'm not below 50% health. See you Teen Wolf. I am just playing from the same match as uh, the same general teams as the fifth, fourth video. Okay, no one's coming yet. It's probably gonna be- yep! Yeah, there we go. Oh, he had ex he had some sort of extra ammo. You can get, a uh, like, po I think it's electric ammo, inf uh, incendiary ammo, explosive ammo, and... Not sure about the last, but they all have their uh, good and bad parts. Basically, it's so like you get a dot added onto your. Oh wow, I got the kill on that. You get a dot added onto your bullets, just like how that's why I like this gas grenade. Eat that. That was a really badly placed grenade. Okay, I'm gonna head this way. But having that dot makes it so that you can pretty much get some good shots in and then leave them alone and not have to worry about them coming back and stabbing you in the arse. Oop. Just smirk. Goodbye. Okay. Tessa's the only one over there. Let's see if we can't get that kill. Triple Wolf is coming over here. Oh, and I go down, but Tenet's able to get the kill. Very nice. Okay. How's our team faring? 37-27? Ooh, very nice. We're doing better than last match, luckily. Don't make myself look like a fool this time. Oh, damn. I know this is an excuse, too, but... For whatever reason, sometimes when I start firing my gun, it'll fire that one bullet. I don't have a burst fire rifle, so I know it's not that. It'll fire one bullet, and then it'll stop firing. It's the most irritating thing, because with a submachine gun, it's supposed to be made so that you can just, like, unload pain and horrible death upon your enemies with no problem. But no, it just makes it painful for me. Oh, God. I know they're coming around the corner in a moment. Like, there! I just, I was unloading my gun, and it was like, oh wait, I'm not gonna stop, I'm not gonna continue shooting for a moment. It may seem like just a moment that I'd have to re-click that button, but in a firefight like this game, where it's so fast-paced, especially on this map, that one second is pretty much life or death. And I know you're... You were around here. Oh! You were around there, and then you found me. Good job! Reviving. I love having uh, someone with the revive on your team. You can really turn around a match if you're able to revive in a good position. Okay, is someone coming around from over there? No. Oh, yes. Nope, they weren't. But 
There we go. It should cover there for just a moment. Give me the time I need to get up here, help this guy out. Okay, nice. He got the kill. Wait. There we go. I always use my pistol for that. Don't want to waste my submachine gun ammo. Right there, gonna come around the corner in just a moment. Ow! I probably should have moved away from that instead of waiting for them to come around anyway. Oh well, I got a little bit of damage into them. It means they have to heal up if they want to get rid of that. So let's see. I know you're up there. And eat that toxic grenade. That was actually a really good throw. Whoa, getting shot at. They're all up there, actually, so let's head up. If I can quickly toss a grenade. Half the good of grenades, for me, is the confusion they cause and how... Ooh, empty hard suit. How after an explosion from a grenade, you're kind of looking around, you have to look through the dust to see where people are. It just makes it a little bit harder to grasp your surrounding. Your sur that totally threw me off because of how it looked. Okay, I need to get down from here. I really need some ammo and some health. And also, I'm going to get picked off soon. I know they're going to come up here. Okay cords up in that, so good time to run out. And there we go. Emma. Okay. Oh! Oh, and we won! Ooh, that was probably loud. I apologize. How'd I do? Fifth place. Decent. Six assists, six, eight kills, eight deaths. Not that bad. I love this map. It's so fast-paced. It's totally different from any of the other maps, too. All of the other maps have so much room to spread out and to fight and to engage each other, and it actually takes more stealth to blindside someone or to flank someone. In this one, you can easily just, in like, two seconds, run around and be like, bam, you're dead, bam, you're dead, bam, you're dead, and then you get shot in the back because you didn't look for, like, a half a second. But that was another match in Blacklight Retribution. I hope you enjoy it. I'll see you next time.